Hello everyone, so here we're going to do another exercise where we're going to try to work out or see if we know the different molecules. As we do this, you'll start to see that it's going to become better. So here's your first molecule, and I would pause if I was you, really sit back and give it some thought. Which one of the nine is this? Okay, so what we see is that this one's got a random oxygen within the main carbon chain, and so straight away, that's your ester. Here's the next one. So the f so so take your time, pause the video, and please have a good try at this one before you hear what I say. So what you would see is that this one has a Cl. Now a Cl is a halogen. Then the rest of the molecule is just single bonds with carbons and hydrogens. Okay. So those single bonds is usually an alkane. So what do you get when you mix halogen and alka alkane? You get halo alkane and so that's this one over here and so here's the next one here we've got this interesting C double bond oxygen but we also have an OH next to it so remember this is that one with Ku now Ku is a carboxylic acid here's a nice easy one guys it's only single bonds with carbon and hydrogen and so that's your alkane with this one we see a triple bond whoops what's happened to our names here sorry about that so here we've got the triple bond now remember a triple bond straight away that's an alkyne first thing we see here is an OH and then if you look at the carbon that it's bonded to that's just a normal carbon there aren't any other fancy double bond oxygens or anything like that so when there's just that OH then it's an alcohol Remember, we can even see OH in the word alcohol. In this molecule, we've got a carbon double bond oxygen in between two carbons. And so that was your ketone. So remember, guys, if you have a carbon with an oxygen and a hydrogen, just like that, and then the rest is all hydrogen and carbons and things like that, that's an alcohol. If you get a double bond oxygen in between two carbons, that's a ketone. If you get a double bond oxygen and then another alcohol part, that's a carboxylic acid. And if you get a double bond oxygen and then a hydrogen like that, and then the rest is carbon, then we call this an aldehyde. And then an ester is the one where you've got carbon, carbon, and then there's like a random oxygen in the carbon chain. That's an ester. And so we say that this one is a ketone. For this one, we've got a double bond oxygen and it's at the very end of the chain. So the, ne the, the hydrogen comes next. And so this is when you've got a double bond oxygen on the side, then it's aldehyde. If it was a double bond oxygen with an OH, then you've got your carboxylic acid again. I truly hope that you guys are starting to see the differences. And then the last one, well obviously we've got a double bond, and so remember that's your alkene. And so that's the end of this lesson. In the next lesson we're going to do something quite cool. We're going to do a little speed test, where I'm not going to do any talking, but you, I'm going to have random molecules popping up on the screen and then the answer will come about two seconds later. So see how many of those you can get right.